I'm Marina, your weight loss coach, Boss Lady Fitness. So today I want to talk about one of the most frustrating and negative types of cycles. It is the cycle of fad diets. One of the one that keeps us on that god awful dieting hamster wheel. Say how to been. So what happens? We we overeat to handle stress, and then we feel guilty. We just we decide to go on a diet, and then we feel deprived. And after feeling deprived for a while, what happens? We cheat on our diets. We eat more. And how do we feel after we eat more? We feel worse, right? So what happens next? We go on another freaking diet. See, food makes us feel good temporarily. And also the result is temporary weight loss. We always end up regaining the weight that we lost because we haven't changed our thoughts or what we eat. So why did we even get in this diet cycle to begin with? Well, after working with hundreds of clients, I found two reasons. One, they weren't taught how to eat the foods that work with their body, the foods that aren't against how their body burns fat or the foods that help them eliminate sugar, chocolate, and carb cravings. Two, they weren't taught how to take advantage of how their brains form habits to form new, healthier habits. So what is the life cycle of fitness? This is the cycle that you wanna be in. So one, we eat well. Two, we feel good. Three, we exercise. Four, we think positive. That sounds amazing, right? So let's go ahead and put that one on repeat. In this cycle, we feel good about ourselves, our health and fitness, our way of life, and we don't need to rely on food to make us feel good. We naturally feel good about ourselves and that's what helps us perform good habits. So why can't we move into the positive cycles and stay there? Why? Why do we keep bouncing back and forth? So the reason can be found on the basis of our behavior. That is the God-given ability to form habits. But we often associate the word habit with bad things. We speak of bad habits all the time, but habits can be good, right? We all have many good habits like brushing our teeth or taking a shower, or turning off the lights when you leave a room. Once a habit is formed, it's hard to break. That's good, except for those bad habits like eating out way too much or drinking too much alcohol. If we do these things over and over again, we'll just keep gaining the weight. We just need to keep our good habits and change the ones that aren't helping us lose the weight. If you want more free tips on how to lose weight, check out my ultimate flat belly guide. Some tips might seem familiar to you and others just might surprise you. But you know the famous quote, to learn and not to do is really not to learn and to know and not to do is really not to know. So I'll leave the link in the section below. And if you're super motivated and just want customized daily workouts sent straight to your phone, Click the link below and that'll take you straight to my app where you can download your free two-week trial. Thanks for joining me. Have a great day. Oh, if you like the video, remember to hit subscribe. And if you want to get notified when I drop some more knowledge on you, go ahead and hit that bell. Peace.